code name Black Chungus. All right, zooms back up. Oh, we're waiting on Javi. Yeah. Yeah, he's not having really. Someone, someone, someone scream his name sensually. Skiffy here? Yeah, I'm here. Love my stuff. Did that work? It takes him. Call him. Call him. He's back to jail. Just because you broke bad once, Walter, doesn't mean anything. Jesse. Just call me breaking. Jesse, I'm breaking bad. I'm back. All right, let's get started. <clears throat> Sorry, game. Uh, Enough of you. Get it out of you. All right. Back to where we left off, boys. You guys are hanging out at Peter's house, and you're just waiting for your the rest of the gang to show up, right? Yeah. Peter Quill. Yeah. yeah. So. This is what happens. After you have your long rest, you guys start making your way towards the town, the city. Mm -hmm. uh, it's you, guys, wait, you guys as in the other people or us? No, them. You okay. guys are just chilling. Okay. I'm about to. Um, <clears throat> yeah, that being said. Uh, wait, wait, where did Javi go? Um, I'm with you guys right now. I'm still... Uh, so, yeah. so you guys will be on route, but what's happening right now is... The hourglass just gets closer, right? You get the, one of the last uh, rings because the bells toll. Uh, and then their approach is kind of like the final hour. Uh, anything you guys want to do? Mm. I want to ask Melodite. Kiss. Who did he, who did he um, get this? Wait, right, who are you talking to, Oscar? Us or other guys? Uh, that's for you guys. You three. Okay. Um, who, who did you make this contact contract with? Some old dudes that we met in the desert who were selling like a bunch of gear, but I didn't have money to pay, so I like took in debt so I could pay it off later. Um, pay off later as in have the money with you or give it to him? Give it to him. So he's, he's in a desert. He's, he's magical, man. He might just kind of appear at some point. I don't no, know. it's really a bitch. Um, what do you think, Grand Wizard? <coughs> I forgot how to do his voice. <laughs> <laughs> um, what was it? Yeah, Just try a few and I'll tell you if you got it. Uh, let's see. <clears throat> so I, I remember being... Uh, kind of sound like a goblin. Kind of like a goblin? Yeah, yeah, yeah. kind of. Except, you know, human. Said you were goblin on these notes. Um. What if? What no, 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 it wouldn't feel like that. Just look back at the stream, no? Uh, I could. Oh wait, it's not up. <laughs> Damn you! Damn it! Ah, hold on. Go to Twitch. Uh, go to vods, and uh, it's fine. Hey. <laughs> Haha. <laughs> Um. Oh, okay. I have it. All right. There you go. There. So, what do you guys want? What is it? We want, your opinion. <laughs> we want your opinion on this tattoo mark that our a buddy Milodite has. Yeah, you, know? you could. Uh, you could pass it to me. Sure. This is related to the golem you saw up here and take the money earlier. Yeah, I was gonna ask about that, but you didn't ask about crit, so it's it's fair. I didn't want to. I didn't want to intro. So uh, he takes it. Uh, and he looks at it, like, hmm. 
This is an hourglass. Yes. Uh, I have no idea what it does. I mean, it could be, it could be anything, to be honest. L loads of spells require hourglasses. And even, you know, double the curses. And I assume this is a curse. That's what I think, too. But it's for a debt. Which is why the golem took the money. Or so. Uh, I don't I mean, know. Uh, who'd you get this from? Some old uh, merchant in the desert. He didn't really talk. He had a bunch of hands and he kind of wrote things on a board when he needed to com like, communicate. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Um, well, that's weird. You know, weird yeah, I don't know. I thought maybe, uh, like, there was a bit more that I owed him or something, which is why I put more money up at, like, to it, but we didn't really have any reaction at all. Um, well, I don't know anything about the man, but this definitely is magical, but I guess we have to wait to figure out what it does. Yeah, that's what I figured. I guess we'll see him in a bit. What if it's a bomb? Nah, Please he'll be fine. It's probably not a bomb. Worst wow. case, it's just gonna, he's gonna take my eyes or something. We got ways around that. Okay, okay. So we just sit here. So you. I guess. So what we got is a golem appeared, took your gold, call it a day, right? Oh yeah. Yeah. I bet now he's just gonna pop up and ask for money. That's it. I bet he's gonna pop up, take my yeah. eyes. We can make that assumption. Nope. So are are you all gonna just wait for it to show up or whatever happens? No. All right. Um, yeah. You guys sit there. Waiting for the hourglass. And the uh, the final bell has tolled as the last grain of sand falls. And nothing happens for a moment. Uh, but suddenly your tattoo ability starts to flare up. It starts to burn. And then it quenches itself as a portal in front of you appears. In front of your eyes. And you all see this. You guys are kind of just sitting in the living room and like this kind of, I don't want to say portal again, but it's sort of like this rift. And uh, <clears throat> you start seeing that a being kind of materializes in front of it. You see that it has wearing a long, uh, rugged cloak, black and holding a scythe. And uh, it speaks to you. God damn it, I don't have this In right my now. mind's eye or whatever, or just kind no, of... No, he's, he's talking. You all see this. He shows up. Hold on. All right. Oh, do, 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 do. Give me a minute. Give me a minute. Give me a minute. You did not bring me my big booty bitch. <laughs> Your trial by death will be you. Huh. Wait, is this just that, that's just for him, right? Not for all of us? Uh, it's mostly just looking at us, Fifi. Okay. Uh, it's in that moment where it, it kind of like it doesn't approach, but it like makes itself bigger and it looks to you and it says, In rolling death in combat, if you fall, your soul is mine. Okay. Can you tell me? Can you tell me what what I needed to do for that last one? Because I, I mean, I paid the gold. Uh, it looks to you and doesn't speak say anything. And as it raises its uh scythe, you hear something else. You hear an assortment of chimes. And uh, and then, the this reaper figure kind of stops. And he turns to the rift and says. Another has chosen to reach. We will succeed. And it's 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 this moment, right, where this reaper thing kind of disappears, but the rift gets bigger. The rift gets bigger, and and something is trying to peer through. And you you see it, right, when it starts peeling its way through. Hold on. Uh. It's, you see the metallic kind of wings and armor that it wears, and another scythe is pierced in, in through and pulled apart to rip this raft, like, wider so it may pass. The first thing that you see when it comes out 
is this plain white mask and its large metallic helm. Uh, Rigby, you remember the chimes. Uh, you'll never forget how they sounded. Fucking Hades pulling through. Uh, in front of you, to everyone who doesn't know what this is, only Gaius, Thanatist, who pierces oh. through the rift. Oh, it's the guy! <laughs> the G. I'll never forget you. You piece this through and you hear the chimes of more, right? They, they start encircling your mind. Uh, and it's kind of like this purple paint is like sprayed onto your like hand. Oh, uh, Melody? Mm. Uh, where you took the tattoo. Yeah. And you see as... It doesn't say a word, but it rips itself... It's attempting to rip itself out of the rift. And it starts trying to crawl towards uh, Gaius to let its wings kind of open up. Uh, however, hold on. A long story. Everything's a long story. I don't know what this is, so I'm just like, whoa. <laughs> Crazy. <laughs> this motherfucker. Yo, no. <laughs> Bro, this is kind of wild. <laughs> you don't want none of this. Uh, hey, it... man, I've been in jail, dude. Not too much for me. You've been in Bro, jail. There's no way you compared half a day in jail. <laughs> This, <laughs> this man, it's been a long day, dude. Hardened like... criminal over here. Yeah, it's been a long day. All right. Fucking Thanatos crawling. Uh, and out and of you the... can, you can hear <laughs> the voice of Hades kind of from the rip, and you can hear. So be uh, it pierces through. Right, Thanatos is doing something. Are you guys doing anything? Oh. Um. Rick's are running, bro. What you talking about? <laughs> Gone. <laughs> is, is Rigby running? I'm a. I'm not gonna run. No, I'm no bitch. I'm not running. Ooh. I'm just holding uh, my. Holding you see, my as that is almost about a breach, but you see Peter, stand off of his chair, and he goes, Bonson. "Not in my home. <laughs> Banishment, you are." Oh! And let me make a save. Uh, and you see as this box is formed around Thanatos, the chains kind of wrap around it, and it's pushed back into the rift. And it's gone. Yeah! <laughs> Yo, Peter! Let's go! You don't Damn. fuck with Peter. That took so much juice from me. We'll get you more rum. We have to celebrate. I want to go pour some rum into my boy Beater's mouth. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> you pour some 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 drink into his mouth. The sips come through, and uh, yeah, the the tattoo kind of fades away just like the other one. So uh, yeah, that's just how it goes. Bro, these motherfuckers want me through dimensions. Like, get off my cock already. The I'll, I'll have you know right now. The only way you ever avoid this fight is if you're not in Peter's home. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I was gonna say let's the, leave. The, 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 the win like, like the win condition was just Peter's home. Everywhere else it was like, all right, fight this nigga. <laughs> well, now, now, I, now I gotta put away this figure I made. I'm not buying it, I guess. What did I have to do? These men just want me to rip my eyes out. No, he uh, just had to fight death. That was it. Yeah, I mean, I guess shit. Damn. Your soul, the, man. Yeah, that's pretty, Oscar. That's pretty wild for like five hundred gold of debt. <laughs> for like five hundred gold of debt. That was just RNG. The... Card. It, 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 it was RNG. legit RNG. He pulled from yeah. the deck of cards. Oh, okay. I was it like, was just that's kind of wild. Yeah. Yeah, that's well, yeah, wild. He got, he got, he he, he rolled lower some shit. He, no, yeah. I didn't. It was a fucking. No, it, it's an assortment of cards, so it, it, there's no ratio. I, I already right know now. what two cards he had pulled, and I was like, shit. <laughs> <laughs> I I knew what the the I didn't know what the golem was gonna do, but I definitely knew what the other one was. Um, yeah. Uh, Peter looks at you and he says, "Well, it's a simple case of uh, you know, trans dimension hopping. You know, they they don't belong here. So if I banish them, they just have to go home." It's just oh, how it no. works. Thank back? God you did that, because those guys hate me. Oh, you know them? He's about uh, to banish you. 
I do. Well, I did. I don't. I don't. It's a long story, man. I don't know how much okay. you want me to talk oh, about. Oh, so you're not from here, huh? You mean I'm from here? No, I'm not. It's actually well. Oscar, do I know that I'm? You know you're not. You're not home. Yeah, you definitely know you're not home anymore. Well, you're not in the place. Yeah, I'm not from here. Yeah, we'll just go with that. It's a complicated. You know what they call you in the circle of wizards? No, I call you an immigrant. Call you an immigrant. I'm sorry, guys. I had to say, I had to say. Okay, Trump, bro. That was the most Trump line you've ever said. <laughs> I had to say, there's no other choice. Bro. There's no other choice. Because, you see, a natural balance must be maintained, and if you're in, if you're not from here, you can't be here. However, that that presence, that that uh, that magic. So feel wait, different. You would have banished me, but does that mean I'm from here? No. I wanna banish you. You help me, you gave oh. me rum. Oh, okay, okay. Man, good thing Thanatos didn't come in with a barrel of rum. <laughs> you want to imagine? For the rummage. Uh and he and he looks at me and he says, Well, uh what what are you, what are we waiting on? What are we hanging out at my house? Uh, yeah, now we're just I kind of want to chill at your house now that I know that you can prevent the god of death from attacking me. Oh, that's a god of death? Yeah, he was a, you know, he's a, he's a bad guy. Well, it, it is the, this is the, this is the, the simple uh, uh, math is that, uh, that if they appear here, they are no longer gods of death. And if the gods of me appear, it's, you know, you lose your power I when, get, you, when you I get what you I get what yeah. you say. Because they're immigrants. This. They are immigrants. Hey, you're immigrant. So you just have to bring him to another dimension to fuck them up. Well, that was the plan in the first game. Was it? Yeah. <laughs> I'm standing here. <laughs> yeah, that was, that was the plan. <clears throat> so, uh, now what? I guess we just hang out here. Okay. I'm bored. I'm okay with that. I wanna... Can, uh... Can you send a message to, uh... The entrance to the city for our friends that get here. Oh, I have no pool. No, I know. I, I don't think you understand. I, I'm not liked here. That's why I live in the suits. Oh what? no, but I just a message that we are here. Unless to, that would be bad. You want to so, tell the guards are here? That's fine. We can no, no, I don't want to tell. No, no, no. Do you? Can you not send your golem to just wait at the entrance to tell our With friends? A sign. <laughs> yeah, yeah that, like a like a fucking like a limousine driver. Well, it's kind of, it's kind of hot outside. Craig's gonna get a little. How about, how about I, get, uh, I think you'll be fine, I guess. How about I go? Want me to go? No, 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 no. I don't want you going anyway. You just, you, you, you're out on bail right now. You're not that ex-criminal. <laughs> yeah. Bro, you're, he went to jail. He's been a hard criminal. I mean, you've been, been, been in jail. And prison changes you. I, I want to, I want, I want to give it a minute. Till we. I, I trump you. Down. Thanatos okay. came to kill us. <laughs> It's true. <laughs> Ed, I I think that wins the the clout argument. Uh, everyone else, uh, Sister and Braun will say for now. And Cassius, you guys, are, you guys try. You know, more hours pass, but you make it. You make it. Uh, <laughs> it, the time doesn't matter anymore. So I won't make. I'm gonna keep track of it. But you know, now it's later in the day, and you make it to the gate. What happens? Well, Sister Rose, you think you got any of those tech priest friends here? Oh, uh, let me take Wait. a look at the fucking How does wall. he know that? You're retarded. <laughs> okay, I know. I'll, be, I'll be just be quiet. Okay. <laughs> That's what <fucked laughs> Just be quiet. Oh, he was fucked up. That's fine. That's fine. No, he he just doesn't know what's going on. That's why. Okay. So, uh, let me take a look at the walls. Do I notice my, my flag colors? Like colors of the fucking church? Uh, you, there, there, there's no colors flying. It's all just hard gray steel that makes up most of the wall. But uh, you do see. I notice the handiwork is advanced. That's about it. Okay. Well, this could be Tuckers' work. Uh, let's go try to get in. Do I do I see like a building or a gate or anything that we can talk? Yeah. To you see a gate. You see some guards posted in the front. Okay, I'll walk up to them. Yeah, with my of course. Group. Uh, you I'm see with them, the, right? Yeah. Yeah. Alright, I, I, I'll walk with them, too. Might as well. Uh, you see, notice you walking forward. 
And uh, one of the officers will press forward and he'll say, uh, Good day, tech priest. <clears throat> this is Officer Jeremiah. What can we help you with? I assume entry to the, to the capital is, is that right? Of course, brother. Uh, no, I'm not affiliated with the... Uh, mm. I just work for the Earls. Maybe Rex, at least go on mute if you don't watch TV. But yeah, re-request entry. That's All right, I well, um... Muted. I, uh, I, okay. Uh, I assume these are with you? Yes. Him? All right. Yes. Uh, any affiliations, the rest of you, or are you also part of the uh, the chapter? Uh, affiliations, you mean like our organizations? Yeah, if you're affiliated with the uh, tech priests, or maybe you're some other merchant guys, or or whatever. Uh, I'm not part of any merchant, but I am part of the the corpses. Ah, mercenary. Well, uh, <clears throat> in that case, uh, we'll let you know that. Um, well, you'll be let in, but we'll be keeping an extra careful eye on you. Nothing personal, just it is what it is because of recent events. They are my, my security detail. Oh, understandable. So am I to assume that this, uh, clean gentleman is also a corpser? Who is the point of talking? Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah, he's fine to me. No, no, he's, he's not one of us. Oh, uh, then but who are you affiliated with? Uh, no one. He is in our traveling group, though. All right. Well, then, yeah, um... Be careful in the desert. Well, then, in that case, uh, he'll hand all three, all of you guys, uh, red cards. Oh, bro. Oh, okay. Cool. We're goaded. Oh, he hands him to you, and, he, and, he, and then, hold on. So in our inventory, do we just put red city card, I guess? Yeah, you can put, uh, if they're called masterwork cards. Okay. Because that's the district that, up to where they let you go to. I feel bad for anybody that has... Actually, mm... I'll say Braun and his, his sister Rose get red cards. But the rest of you get a common citadel, the brown ones. Okay. Well, but where did body gone? So you just said it. Yeah, but you just you just bodyguard says it. Oh, that's bullshit. I, I think I, if I I'm with card. you, you're fine. But if you try to go in alone, that's when the trouble happens. Fair. Uh, but at least you don't got any of those. Uh, what, what's lower than brown guard? Black. Well, I'm asking the guard. What's lower than what? Look. These are the highest, I guess, access, right? Nope. No? I was sorry to say, but the Earl's Pearl Estates are above simply because they're high, uh, they're very important people that need to be protected. You understand, also? Yeah. Nice. Most of the shops there are high detail and. We can't assume that everyone has the coin. Robberies happen all the time, and it's better to just seal them off to those who can actually pay. Mm. Not, not, nothing of difference, of course. We protect the city all the same. Yeah. Well, understandable. Okay. Well, after he gives us the cards, I'll, uh, you know, say goodbye. Uh, I'll inform Graia of your arrival. Uh, what is your name? My name is Ciceros Delphix. All right, Ciceros. I'll let Gr Graia know that you're here. Mm -hmm. uh, and with that, they open the gates and they let you through. Uh, welcome to the city of Blackwater, Team B. Let's go. Woo! Oh, uh, waiting, be waiting behind these uh, gates is this kind of like. Uh, average looking Joe with a sign that just says bronze this is us, like and shit written on it. Well this is for us. I, I I think I think this thing's waiting for us here, huh? Yeah. Uh maybe it's from the people you left behind. I mean I'd hope so. I hope they're not dead. Yeah. I mean what are the chances like the god of death is gonna take me nothing. 
Who is the guard death? Oh, All I know the machine guard. Right. Guard <laughs> I'd approach this Joe Schmo with a sign. Uh, he looks and he says, Ron, is that you? That is me. Let's go. And he, move, and he starts moving down the hallway. Uh, I'd start following and I'd look back to make sure my boys are following. Yeah, we're, we're going yeah. along. Yeah, yeah, so the, the gate in front of you is well made, and you just head to the left of this, like, dirty hallway. It goes downward. Uh, and as you, you know, step farther and farther, the smell gets worse, and you finally see it. The soots. The underground, as the signs show tell you. Uh, and he's going to start leading you towards the wizard tower. Anything you guys want to do on the way there, or are you just going to follow? Violet? Uh, Can you tell me any... Like, will we pass? Like, do we pass any like interesting statues or anything like that? Uh, there's no statues. It's mostly all just buildings. At least of that effect. Oh, like uh, stone made buildings. What's up? I want to take a short rest while I wait for these boys to show up. Sure. You need a short rest, Peter. He's already taking a short rest. Uh, yeah. You guys make it down. Cassius talks to you guys. He's like, well, "Why are we following this random guy?" Cassis, if you remember, uh, I, I dropped off three people from our part here earlier, and I assume this has to do with them. Okay. But what if they died and they're just going to kill us too? You're, you're too negative, man. Get out of here. Yeah. Well, okay. Well, that's fine. But uh, I, ha- I, have to he- I have to head over to the forge after, so I hope you just get out of here in time. Yeah we'll, yeah, we'll be in and out quick, but it seems pretty sketchy. Keep an eye on your shit. Oh, yeah, uh, yeah I will. And he's going to start actively making sure no one's stealing from the cart. Cool. Yeah. All right. Well, you guys just, what else are you going to do while you follow or nothing else? Uh, I, I keep following. I keep an offer for suspicious figures and such, but I'd mainly just be following this guy. Uh, yes, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to look around for, like, shops and what they're selling. You see many shops. You see shops uh, that sell, you know, food, right? Packaged mm-hmm. and stored. You see people that are other bars that are selling things, as things to drink. Um, you see someone brewing something in the middle of like a pond. Yeah. Okay. All right. I'll just I'll just keep a note of like uh, the stores and everything, just in case I want to come back and buy some. I know it's All a right. shady part of town, but hey, bro. sometimes they got oh, the best fine. shit. A uh, rogue. You don't really see a statue or a lamp per se. Uh, there are yeah, lights. There is like lights al- around, but they're not like lamp posts. They're just like strings yeah. of like high beams. But is anywhere that can like be publicly seen? I guess. Yeah, there's many places that can be publicly seen. Mm. Like just walls in general. Yeah. Can I do it in like an alleyway? <laughs> no. No, it won't count. Nope. Okay. Well, hmm. I guess I'll just keep going then. For now. All right. You keep on moving. <clears throat> and it takes you a while to get there, but you finally make it to the Wizard's Tower. And uh, you're let in. The Krieg opens the door. And when he opens it, you see all your friends just kind of sitting on couches and chairs. And you just see, like, Peter just kind of sl- slumped on the chair. Are they playing Chilla. that game? Yeah, they could be playing the game. Did I see right. Melody? You see Melody. Ah, right. oh, Melody, look who's not dead. Crazy shit happened. Yo, you still got, you still got no hand? I, I, I got no hand, but here's my other hand. Look, the tattoo. Whoa. We made, we made it, boys. What was that about? What happened? Uh, you know, we paid it off, and then, uh, it was supposed to be gone. One of them would disappear, the other one didn't, and so we just kind of waited, and then, like, some crazy shit, some dude came through, and it was, like, time to take a trial by death, and then some other dude ripped open the portal. Seems like he knew Gaius over here, but he, he was, like, he needed our soul, I guess. But then our, our good friend Peter here, he, he's super cool, and apparently really strong he was just he kind of was like be gone and he banished them so we're good yeah 
Well, uh, I, I'd well, say is you anybody could, a perk? Could get it done. <laughs> Yeah, I'm, I'm chilling right now. I mean, I'm missing two health, but oh, oh yeah, and uh, uh, night eye over here went to prison for a bit. Yeah, night eye, you went to prison? Drop yeah. Soap? So Oscar, oh. I'm gonna touch Gaius and give him two HP back. All right. Thank you. I'm gonna touch him in the in the I guess in the back of the neck. All right. I got a little something for y'all real quick. Just to clarify, we did pay back Spiffy's debt. Uh, but the thing is, we may have uh, acquired the money in a dubious way. Uh, if me and me and uh, Melody weren't really implicated in it, that people know of. But uh, if Night Eye gets uh, killed, uh, that might be why. There might be people that are trying to find him. I'd assume. What you guys did? Oh, uh, wait. You guys didn't. Yeah, fuck. Well, I didn't yes. expect you guys to come up with this money legitimately. That's why not. Yeah. Right. But the thing is, I don't know who we got the who we got the job from or who we stole the stuff from. So, yeah, it's kind of up in the air right now. That's why I, I'd rather lay low. Or at least me or us three for a little bit. I'm mm. down for laying low oh. for a while. I need some things yeah. I need to get It's kind of nice down here, well, too. Uh, well, I'll probably be going, making, going to the temple and maybe the forge. Yeah, I'm sure you guys are fine. Hey, can I get uh, healed up, please? Where are you? Where are you? Okay. What are you, what are you, what are you wearing? Is, is Peter awesome. awake right now, uh, Oscar? Peter. Hey, Peter. Yeah, can you describe what Nida is wearing? I need him. I was like, can you describe what Nida is wearing? That, that's a question for you, Javier. Oh, I'm just wearing regular, my regular gear. My fucking robes and shit. So, okay. Yeah, I mean, I didn't really... I'll touch you and I'll give you a little... Yo! Uh, let's see. I'm on five health right now. Give you a little eight healing. Yeah. I'm lucky. You rolled a little low, but it is what it is. It is what it is. Still keeps you from death, at least. Yeah, and so prison ain't that bad, man. Well, I mean, it's pretty shitty, but, you know. <laughs> what do you mean? How long were you there for? Like, 30 minutes. It would have worked if the shitty guards weren't so fucking pushy. But, you know, yeah, I, guess, I guess those aren't shitty guards, then, huh? <laughs> yeah. Anyway, you guys should... Who, anyway, who's this? And I'll point to the fucking Peter. Oh, this is the Grand Wizard. Give me a minute. Uh, Give me a minute. You'll meet the Grand Wizard in a bit. Very busy. Uh, the wizard, you say? Well, yes. he's probably not gonna like me. Uh, yeah, probably yeah. not. Yeah. <laughs> but he is pretty cool. He did just stop a god or two from uh, killing us three, which was mm. nice of him. Damn a whole a whole I god. Need to how he did the... Do you guys do you guys know who uh, Thanatos or Hades are? No, I, I don't think so. Okay. Well. You know, God of Death and the God of the Underworld. And he just kind of banished them. I've never seen anything like it. It was very impressive. Even when oh. I was meeting these guys in the in where they originally come from, they were pretty cracked. But apparently, if they come over here, they're not really cracked. So, that was, that was good to see. Because we almost had to fight some, some real menaces. Mm-hmm. But, uh, can you tell me about this whole fucking whatever your religion thing is going on? Because I don't know anything about it, and I keep getting asked about it. Oh, you mean the Church of the Machine God? Yeah. All right, I'm back. What happened? Uh, I need to tell Rex about my religion now. Uh, sure. Go for it. Well, the machine god, Orling Tora, basically a god. Oh, wait, hold on, hold on. Sorry, sorry. Back oh. it up, back it up, because I wasn't here. Okay. So, you guys enter the house, right? Ron yeah. talks, I know that. Uh, Cicero's, uh, as you guys, the rest of you enter, right? Udio, you come in. Uh, Cicero's, when you entered, Peter gets up from his chair. He's like, leave. You leave. 
You leave now. You. You text priest. You leave. Get out of here. Get out of here. No, no. No, I'm Peter, not going to have Peter, you. No, get Peter, out. Peter, no. Peter, Peter, Peter. He's with us. No. He's with us. I'll he's blow a, him he's, up. He's, he's I'll blow a him good up one. Right now. He's a good one. He's yes, a good fine. One. I don't care. I don't he's care. A good one. I'm going to blow him up in five seconds. He's one of the good five, ones. Five, four. I, I, I push him out the door. I'm like, three. come on, come on, let's go. <laughs> Peter, what's going I want to throw him the paper I've been writing. It's the Peter. damn tech priest. They got to take what? it over the town for years, and and they they oppress the people, and that's why I have to kill them. He's he's not one of those tech priests. No, they're all the same. They all come. From <laughs> no, he's, he's from he's from a different. He's from sect. a different sect. I, I remember him saying stuff about sex. And... You know about Islam. Yeah, there's different forge, uh, different forges. They're all made. They're all built. They're all disgusting. Do you know about? Hey, there's no, there's no life in there. There's no soul. Look at him. Look at him. No soul. I'm looking Where's at the flesh? him. flesh? Nowhere. I'm looking at him. No, no flesh. No soul. Hey, I've there. seen this man dance. He has soul. Now believe him, me, he's eyes. not one of these dirty tech priests you're talking about. He may be part of the same religion, but there's individually, he's a good. The guy. apple doesn't fall too far from the tree, guys. He's not like you. Look at you. What? What? Yeah, he's not falling far. Look, I, I, not, I, I, wait, 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 wait. Peter, Peter, there is do? not an ounce of flesh in this thing you call guys. No, but he's not wearing the same garb. Look at him. He's what? his own person. You put, you put, design. you put, you put Cicero's clothes on Rigby. You'd hate Rigby. No, would it? The design's much different. Look at him. <laughs> Does that look like a hard, cold tech priest? What, what, what would it take for you to not hate Cicero's? Huh? Ah. What would it take for you to not? Who's hate talking it? first? There's two people that are talking. Me. I'm talking. Night eye. Okay. One okay. and only. What would it take for you to not hate him? Ah. Uh, uh, he uh, denounces his religion. He uh, uh, reverts. Uh, he reverts his body to the way it was before. Okay. Uh -huh. okay. Okay. Yeah. And then um. Okay. Uh huh. Uh, oh, we're following. Uh, and uh. Up, yeah. Oh. <laughs> yeah. And 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 you know yeah, he's, uh, he helps people. There's somebody. Okay. So that's my, that's my those are my. Well, men. he's okay. done the last okay. one. Well, well, yeah. Well, ultimately, I, I I don't care if we hang out there all the time. I just got a question for you, Mike, Peter. Hmm. Uh, I'll go up to him. I'm, I'm whisper to him, and I'm gonna I'm gonna ask him a question. I'm gonna send it to you, Oscar. Okay. I'm asking if he knows about this. You walk up to his ear. You have to ask him, Kevin. You have to ask him. I'm gonna go up to I'm gonna go up to his ear, and I'm like, "Hey, I'm wondering if you've heard about this thing. It's called what? Joe's Sloppy Special." What do you know about Joe's Sloppy Special, Peter? I know a lot about Joe's Sloppy Special. Where do you want Joe's Sloppy Special? Ain't no way. Oh. Write it on this piece of paper. <laughs> and then uh, I'll get back to you on that. Do we hear this? Do we hear this? Joe's Sloppy Special. No, he's special. whipping. No, he's whispering. <laughs> Listen, I, I don't have an eye, so my my ear must be better. <laughs> yeah, <sure>. <laughs> <laughs> what do you want him to do, uh, Bron? Uh, I'm gonna bring out a piece of paper, which I'm pretty sure I have, and then I'm gonna have him write on it. No, no, you you can't write the Joe Sloppy Special. Yeah, let, let me show you the Joe Sloppy Special. No, 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 no. He's gonna he's gonna walk over. Here. No, he's gonna he's gonna clap his hands right, and the fridge on the on the side will like start walking towards him. Sick. He's like no. Nah. Well, you personally asked for this, but not many people want it. And he pulls out this, like, how do I say it? It's like a two-handed sub. Inside of it is like a collection of meat. You can't differentiate what it is. Some chili on top. Then there's cheese that has melted from on top of the bread. Oh, that's pretty sick. Only, 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 only bronze are going to And it's wrapped in tinfoil. And he's like, I don't think you're ready for Joe's Sloppy Special. Right, I'll, I'll be back in a bit. I think I'm ready for Joe's Sloppy Special. I don't think you are. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah, have 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 the special. I had to use the Joe Sloppy special. This is huge. Yeah, you be bit. careful. You be careful. Nah, I'll take Joe Sloppy special. 
shove it in my pocket and uh, be like, I know, good <laughs> doing business with you. This, this is this is a, like a, hell, it's not even just a two hander. He's like he's like bad but You can't just slap it in your your pocket. I'll put it in like the inside of my coat. <laughs> okay. <laughs> and then uh, and with that, I'm like, all right, well, I won't bother you anymore, Peter. And I'll go outside with Cicero's. I thought you guys were cool, guys. I thought you guys were cool. We are cool. Why are you hanging around with the tech priests? You saw, it was just a setup. Did you tell me the product just so you could arrest me? No. No. no, no arrest me right now, you goddamn it. Wouldn't, you wouldn't believe how far off the truth you are. Yeah. Grand from, where I, from where I'm standing, it looks like you just set me up and the tech priest is going to arrest me and eviscerate my body. Or well, if you're what standing the there, you should stand over there, and I'm gonna point a few feet away, cause you ain't got the whole picture. <laughs> you, you're gonna take psychic damage for that shitty <laughs> show. That shit was you fun. I'm gonna, I'm not, I'm not gonna make it to the medieval times, Kevin. I'm gonna kill myself. <laughs> yeah, that's good. Right, yeah. right. <laughs> All right. But anyway, you said that to him. He thinks it's funny. He, th he thinks it's funny. I don't think it's funny. <laughs> he laughs and he's like, okay. Okay. So you're hanging around the tech booth, whatever. Now, what, is, what are you going to do now? Let's see. Mr. Grand Wizard. Peter, if I will. Yes. What did the tech priest do to you? Just cause, See, just out of curiosity, because I want to know where you're coming from. See, it happened uh, 100 years ago. Right. As you're talking, I'm going to pour him a shot, or I'm going to pour him some rum. 100 years ago, I was hanging around here when this was still just a normal frontier town. And the Earls had respect for me. They said, Grand Wizard, Grand Wizard, we need help destroying these sandworms. And I, you know what I did? Gracious from my heart. I said, I will destroy the sandworms. And I did. But I said I needed a diamond. Because only uh, my power can only be influenced through a diamond. They said, oh, that's too much. It was worth for the town. Then they said, oh, Grand Wizard, the town needs water. You know what I did? I gave them water. But then, times got tough. The kingdom of the Lunar and the tricks, they, they started abandoning. The orc tribes left this continent. And pretty soon they couldn't afford the wizard. And the wizard tried to help, but they decided, why help the wizard anymore when we have the priests? Now the priests! The dangerous folk. See, they don't care about people. They don't care. They only subsequently care because it's in the same line of thinking. See, in the night, they'll take poor children and women and men. And they'll and they'll test on them. I've seen it, and I and I can tell you for certain that they don't care about who you are, what you've done. You're just a number on the screen, and that's why we don't like the tech priest. Um, can I can I say something? Oh, sure. Is that wait, wait you, you see running running back? Is you said that they take children, right? They don't care. It could be anyway, okay. it could be a dog. Oh, that might be that lady dog. Yeah, I was, about, I was about to say that right now. Like, yeah, is it is it possible that uh, the both like the child that's missing, like the tech priest or what? A, a lot of childs go missing. I don't know which which every single one you know talking about. Send them the form. Would you have it, Spiffy? Oh, I have it. Oh, yeah. sorry. I could I could hand him the form, but I'm gonna let him finish talking. Okay. Okay. He's going. Yeah, they all started off, they started off helping the people. But as soon as they had their finger inside the politics, it all changed. See, I right now, that's why I'm here in the soots. I help out the people here. I make sure they have clean water. I make sure that, that the mud beasts don't kill them. I try my best. So would you say that the tech priests have oppressed the people of the soots? Oh, uh, yeah, I would say so. Would you also say that they have been abusing the political power that they've gained? Most definitely. I'm kind of kind of on your side, buddy. And you've been helping these proletariats down here, haven't you? 
Yes, yes, yes. I am I myself. I've been helping people. I think I upped his fucking vocabulary for this conversation. <laughs> God. So thou shalt. No, I'm just kidding. Thou shalt not steal. Thou shalt not murder. Steal. Ah. Steal from the tech priest. Fuck him. That's what I'm saying. But, but, are these tech priests, are all tech priests one and the same? Yes. Yes, they are. are. All, because from what I've seen, now I have not known this man very long, but what, from what I've seen, this man, Ciceros, has been a good, a good man. I have not seen him do no wrong. Mm, so it's hard know. for me, coming from my anecdotal point of view, to completely agree with you that he is a bad man just due oh. to his religion. Well, tell me this. Has he ever helped someone out of the kind of his heart? Or has he ever helped one of you because you were in a dangerous situation and it was just better if you worked together? He, he does that more often than not. There's been many a time he has saved me from death. Because you, my... were in a, you were in a combat situation, am I right? I mean, I he bet. just healed our, our friend here, and then yeah, he left when you kicked him out. Well, I'm no weakling. I would not die in a non-combat situation. It's okay than, to go down. I, I'm, I'm tired. Unless, a, unless a pyramid would take me out. But besides that... <laughs> yeah, I so did. there, big guy. <laughs> <laughs> but, um... Yes, in combat, he has helped me. Yeah, they're just not good people. They, 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 they just not, they're not even people anymore. You haven't even spoken to him. I don't need give, to. Give your leg a shake and speak to him. <laughs> give your leg a shake. Yeah. All right, yeah. roll me a persuasion. <laughs> give your head a shake, nigga. <laughs> give your leg a shake. Give your head a shake. Let me just <laughs> do the stanky leg. Do the stanky leg. Persuasion? Give uh, your head a shake. Where was that fucking from? Dude? Norm. <laughs> Norm. <laughs> Give your head a shake. <laughs> Give your head a shake. Good. A dead 20! Give your head a shake. Give your leg a shake. Peter. Uh, hold on, Give hold on. This reminds me I forgot to record your Nat 20 initiative. Oh, yeah, that's true. So, yeah. okay, persuasion. Give your head a shake. Give your leg a shake. Give your leg a shake, <laughs> not your head. Dude, now, come on, give your leg. Come on, give your leg. Okay, I have to go back to my notes. Oh, I have this <sighs> fat chunk right here. Okay. Was it safe to okay. say you're going to give him a chance, Peter? Hey, eh? let, him, wait, let him talk. Hey, I just said, oh, yeah. Give your leg a shake and talk to my man, Ciceros. He is a good man. I don't know. Oh, um. Yeah, you can let him in. All right, I'm, I'm a, I'm a wave over. But I always have over. this bomb ready. <laughs> you Jeez. can have the bomb ready. This is your domain. You can, you can. Have whatever. I'm be outside with this. It's like, wow, man, it's like the fucking goblin shit all over again, dude. Like, what's up with mm. these racially <laughs> prejudiced people? I don't know. To be what fair, I can see where he's coming from. Cause, did you hear the whole story? I'm outside. We didn't hear shit. He's outside. I didn't okay. hear anything. We don't, we don't get any lure. All right. Well, I'm gonna I'm wave over to to bring him in. Okay. We we walking. Yeah. Really start, dude. Yeah, and I'll be like, Ciceros, this, this is a, the Grand Wizard. And just Welcome. to give you. Oh, to your grave. Like... <laughs> <laughs> God, you just, I'm joking, I'm joking, I'm joking, I'm not saying that. <laughs> just kill him. <laughs> <laughs> no, but I'm gonna be like, the Ciceros, uh, the Grand Wizard comes from a. A dark history with the with the with the mechanic priest. I already forgot what the fuck you guys are called. What is it, what is it? mechanic priest or? Uh... Tech priest. The mechanic tech, is, but they're also tech, tech priest. Priests. Yeah, tech priest. The tech priest of this kingdom screwed him over and, and kicked him down to the soots. And I've been 
dealing in shady activities with the people. So, seen from his perspective, he he's only dealt with bad tech priests. Waiting so for Cicero I, I, to be like, he's a dirty fucking wizard. What do you expect? <laughs> <laughs> Uh, if only that was the character arc I was going for. What is it on? <laughs> um, yeah, I mean, well, uh, it's logical that he would hate us. Not Look at him. Look at him logic. He has no feeling. <laughs> but it is strange that tech priests would kidnap people and use them unwillingly. That's normally not how things go. Evil. <laughs> Concerning, at least back on the other continent, tech priests are more or less akin to helping poor, running donations, food banks, etc. We tend to Always usually help poor food. people, but it's strange that tech priests here would neglect people less fortunate, considering our story of our god revolves around a poor fisherman being aided by technology. Wow, that is so interesting. That is that is so interesting. I'm gonna write it down yeah. right now. And he's gonna pretend to write it down. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Wow. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You gotta give him a give him a chance, man. He's hey, not... Regardless, though, I would like to have a cordial conversation. Yeah. <clears throat> Anyways, I would I would like to. Grand Wizard, do you have any plans on uh? On helping fixing the kingdom of Lenar, maybe reforming these. Well, these, the entire these, kingdom. These misguided tech priests. Oh, I, well. I think he's just talking about Blackwater. Oh, I, I, I'm talking about Blackwater. We gotta start small. Oh, right? that, yeah. to get rid of the, See, the, the, the tech priests are very, are very difficult to deal with because they have these things called Goss Canyons. You ever heard of a Goss Cannon? No. Yes. Oh, <laughs> yeah, I bet you know tech priests. No. I bet you know. Yeah, you do not want to be on the end of them. They'll they'll not rip any gosh. beast in half. It's it's insane. And then they have heavily guarded snipers. They have assassins yeah. that can follow you in the net. See, they they're very they, they say good, and then they have this mass armory that have they've created for only war and destruction. It's kind of uh, like a double edged sword. I don't understand. Mm. I mean, it goes back through our history, but I understand that you do not want to hear it. Regardless, though, it is strange that tech priests would kidnap people. I'm also of the belief that having the biggest gun makes you the safest person in the room. So yeah, having not... having the biggest gun around does help with keeping peace, but in the in the hands of the wrong people, it could definitely be a a bad thing. Well, how, what if like all the guns were on the same person? Like would that would that still be true? Like he, he, sure one gun, but like all of them. Every single one. Now, to say the tech priests are the only ones with firearms is just wrong. That's not what I said. I was using the metaphor. <laughs> well, do you not understand? Oh, oh you poor child. Oh, I, anyway. I got the metaphor. But using the metaphor that way is also just wrong. Because other people have guns. Well, I'm, I'm in the middle of some... I guess research, and I was wondering if you could help me with it. No, I don't want anything to do with your research. You haven't heard what the research is about? What's the research about? Guys is right, guys is very, very right. I'll, uh, I'll basically pull out the paper I've been writing. And I do have a paper that I've been writing on screen. <laughs> okay. Yeah, let me. You have a fax machine over there? <laughs> yeah, you gotta, can, can I make a copy or is this only scan? Yeah, yeah. There you go, Oscar. You ran out of ink. <laughs> God damn it! It's always it's always the black one. No, it's always the blue, and I never I never use blue. I don't understand. There you go, Oscar. Well, that's how much I have written. Cause... Any of you guys have a bottle of coke? Send me the invite, child. I did. No, you, you, you said I need a request. You didn't have to like, give oh. me permission. Who left? Or was that the music bot? Bro, yeah. Oh, yeah. He, went, he went to sleepy time. Sleepy time? At 6? 
Exactly. Okay. Still need okay. access. Yeah. yeah, here we go. Try that one. That might work. There you go. YouTube. Uh, YouTube us <laughs> So he reads it. And uh, he's like, okay. Uh, uh, enjoy. Does he does he actually understand what it's written, or does he does he need help understanding? It? That's all he's gonna say. Uh, enjoy, I guess. Uh, I don't know what you want me to do with this paper. I can throw it in the trash for you if you want. <laughs> well, I need you to help me learn about magic. That's funny. I'm not gonna do that. Why would I give you? Hey, why would on. I give you the ability to control magic? That's that's insane. Come on, Peter. Why not? Why? Not? I, I I already hate the tech priests. Why would I give them? Why would they? Why would I give them guns dude, and magic? Uh, dude, what dude, if dude, What if he can help us with our cause? Yeah. You don't have to do it for me. Do it for Blackwater. But yeah. Do it for Blackwater. I, don't worry about Blackwater. I definitely doesn't need the help of some tech priest. This conversation is hurting me and my fucking brain damaged head. I'm gonna go wait outside. Okay. I forgot about that. <laughs> Someone's got to go drain his fucking skull of all the liquid that's built up. Okay, well, I guess he's not... So, can I, can I persuade him to help us out? What? Can I persuade oh, yeah. him? Wait, Cicero, okay. Yeah. First of all, I don't think you can uh. persuade him. But, Cicero, what, what are you planning to do? My so, plan. Or, I don't know, go ahead. You can go ahead, Peter, if you want to explain it. So, what he, what I just read, is that he wants to combine the ability to use magic with technology, which is insane. It's like trying to bend the natural order to your will, and that's preposterous. It doesn't belong to you. But aren't you using magic and bending it? No, no. I have a deep understanding. And with that deep understanding, I'm allowed to kind of curve it around. I'm allowed to use it, but there are requirements. I must respect it. I cannot just do whatever I want whenever do, I want. Do, do Can we know the requirements? No! That's years of study. I'm not just going to tell you things and then let you half-ass it. What if you blow yourself up? And there's people around. This is why we study. This is why we, we take so much care. It's a, well, it's a combination of study yeah, and it's a combination. Yeah, I get you. We have to study it. Why not? Why not tell us the like? Give us a little hint about the books that we should you know, to read. That way, we can build our knowledge on this. Okay, I don't. I don't think. Yeah, I don't think. You you be, do you want to? Do you want it? What? I'm confused. Do you you think you just read it and that's it? Mm. Yeah. Regardless, this is the whole point. Oh. So that we don't need those years of study. People could make food out of thin air if they wanted to. The years of study are necessary. Why do you think it takes so long so that people don't do stupid things? That's what I'm saying. Technology could help make it easier. Make it easier for that child in the slums to be able to conjure food for himself every morning. Make it easier for a family to feed themselves, get them clean water. No, no, you don't understand. You're going to be overpopulating the amount of people who have access to the weave. Why do you think there's so little amount of people that can use magic at a time? What If everyone knew how to abuse the weave, what do you think would happen? If everyone could just access the little little line of life, don't you think, you know, that puts a little strain on it? Especially when you're, when just, if you just teach anyone to do it, anyone who's not going to be proficient in it will just kind of pull it out, force it to happen. The right quantities won't be taken out. The right kind of backtracks won't be taken account of. It'll be pandemonium. This is why study is required. This is but why that's you, why you the use technology ties. to replace the study. So you, you don't, don't replace the study. You never replace the study. Foolish you are. 
foolish to think you could just substitute time and effort with a button. I think there's a happy medium, though, of requiring study, but also making it so that the weave could be used for good in the sense of humanitarian efforts. It's a dangerous game. It is, but that's why information and and study, as you as you put it, is is mandatory. But also, technology could help with the ease of access. I don't believe so. I've been long here long enough to know that even in the Drukhari War, the moment we gave them magic, we taught them how to use it, all they did was use it to blow up other kingdoms and take over villages. Mm. In the right hands depends on whose Holt wheels wielding it. Besides, you just want me to help you for no, for no reason? No, no. Okay. How about this? I, I, I don't like asking for help with nothing in return. If we can perhaps change something for the better in this, in this, it's not a kingdom. What the fuck is this it? Town? This city. This city. In, in this, this city, city, then would you maybe reconsider and help us? Let me change something. I don't know what do you. What would you think would be a positive thing oh, yeah. that we could help with? You blow up the forge. The whole the, the giant tower. Jesus. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Why? What? What would blowing up the forge do? Gets rid of the tech priests. Okay, it's but weird. what if I will it tell wouldn't you get rid of the? I think that would make it way worse. I, I will make it win. once they're gone. I can continue to push forward. Unless and, also, and then move on to the earls. The earls need to go too. Okay. Because I think well, if we blow, up, I think if we blow up the forge, it would more anger the tech priests than get rid of them. Be as angry as they want. Oh, uh, them dead is what I want. So let me get this straight. You're telling me, if they come back, they cut the tech priests come back, they get more pissed. You're gonna be able to stop them. Hmm. Okay, to be fair, well, he did stop a god a second ago. But <laughs> we got yeah, yeah, one, though. Yeah, yeah one. The point. And there's a lot of it was, tech priests. It was actually two, but still. Oh my god. Regardless, I okay, don't think but, he can do no, that no, no, to no, every no. Hold on, hold on. He stopped, he stopped the gods because we're in his place. If he was in his place, who knows? Am I, am I, am I reading that right? Also, a piece of information you guys aren't remembering is he's gassed. Hmm. Yeah. And, I, you say? I didn't hear what you said. Yeah. What did you say? Yeah. Oh, I'm just reminding you guys. Like, I'm not there, but I'm sure you guys forgot. But he's he's gassed from that. So I'm oh yeah. Do it twice in a row. Oh. Yeah, that's true. Well, anyways. Okay. Well, that's what I'm asking, Peter. You're thinking you'd be able to stop more tech priests if they come over here? Once, once we blow up the forge, that'll hurt them. And then we get rid of the earls. They lose their connection. And it's a small kind of underground who's, thing that will Who's we... to say they won't come back? Who's to say we won't come back? Me. I'll make sure they never come back. Are you positive? Well, I can only try. That's true. I can't control the future. Okay, yeah, but that's, that, that's not a guarantee, though. That's a maybe. A lot of things are maybes. Yeah, yeah. So you think blowing up the forge would help this cause? Hmm. Mm. Yes. Uh, what do you think about that, Cicero's? Yeah, no, it was a bad idea. Yeah, I, I think it's a bad idea in the sense that you might start a war with tech priests. That They've already attacked me for years. But, so what, what, am I not allowed to fight back? No, but do we have enough uh, people on, on your side, on our no, side? No, we don't use people. That's the difference. I don't use people. I use Craig's. And he just shows you like the five No Craig's fucking fuck. No way. <laughs> <laughs> okay. You're stronger than you think. I use them from incognito, but at a moment's notice. Uh, how, about, how about we put that to the test? Are they stronger? Can I punch a Craig to test its strength? Why? Why not? 
I, oh, you said it's strong. Can it take one of my punches? Sure. Are you going to allow me to punch you? I want to test how strong oh, you are. I, I, I guess. Go, Craig. Go, let him punch you. And one of the Craigs will it'll just stand there. You want, to, you want me to roll the hit? Yeah, I'll roll the hit. Oh, he's letting them punch him. Yeah. yeah. Oh, so yeah. Uh, roll damage. Okay. Seven damage. Let's go. One stack. It's going up, baby. All right. <laughs> I punched the Craig. Okay. You, you punch the Craig, and like nothing happens. It's solid. How many Craigs? How many Craigs do you have? You're well, with this powder man. that I was just given, I had an infinite amount. Oh, that's true. We did just give this nigga a fucking shit ton of. Oh my god. Yeah. Did you say infinite amount? Essentially, if I can do it right, as many as we need for the fight. I mean, yo, he. I mean, yo, he took a punch, and he has a lot. I mean, if the if the Craig doesn't look phased at all. See, it's important because I have to make enough to where I can fight off the tech priests, and enough so that the rest can protect the people while this is going on. How long do you need to prepare? Mm. I'm just asking. I'm just saying we're gonna do it. I'm, I'm gonna tell you right now. This is a bad idea. Who can say? I won't stop you, but this is definitely a bad idea. Hmm. Yeah, Bron checked out of this conversation early because it's, it's going <laughs> it's not going to go anywhere good. Yeah, like yeah, the whole the whole blowing up the forge. I don't see the. Like, I, I, I I I never saw the point of trying to convince this crazy old guy to fucking like Cicero's to begin with. Or like we just leave, just go somewhere yeah. else. I mean, he did. I mean, he helped us out. I mean, I mean sure, it. but he also doesn't like Cicero's. So why do we have to make him like Cicero's? Bro, well, this dude is strong as fuck. If we could have to have <laughs> yeah, yeah. I, You're not I, here, Kevin. Deny yourself. I don't know. I'm not talking as my character. I'm just talking as like we're, so, we're talking. We're doing something. Well, yeah, but, but I, I see, well Kevin, I see it as like we have this strong dude that like kind of agrees with, well, at least with my like viewpoint. So if we could like get him to fight with us for whatever the fuck's happening, because I don't even know what you guys are doing anymore. I don't know if this whole cash is. I mean, I don't out. even know why we're believing anything this guy says in the first place. Either. Well, I mean, it kind of checks out. I mean, there's kids missing. You know what I mean? Yeah, but it doesn't have uh, to I'm be the I'm not saying, I'm not that I'm are not, doing it either. I, 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 I'm, I'm I, I haven't sure. agreed to help him yet. I just... No, we're just asking questions. We're not saying, hey, let's do it. You know what I mean? We're saying, I mean, but at this point, you're just riling him up to go to war regardless of what your questions are asking. He wants to go to war regardless. I don't, just saying he wants yeah, to but you're edging him off. So I don't think that, you know, any solution where well, any, any problem where your solution... Okay, okay, no more talking if you're not in the conversation. Uh, that, that's it. Even to the players. Focus on the moment. Let's get through this. People, okay. well, what do you see? Regardless, well, if you want to go to war, you can try. But I don't think it's good for you or the, the people that you seek to protect. And the then he'll just get safe. his paper and walk out. All right. So I see, guys. What's up? You don't like blowing up the forge? I just don't know if it's the right thing to do right now. I, well, I, don't, not, I, I can't do it right now, but... Yeah, well, also, I also don't know enough about everything. I need I need more context to truly help. Uh, I don't know what more context you need. Most of the people live underground. Well, not most. A lot of the people live underground. Who do you think put them there, guys? I don't think they chose to live here. Bro, what but fine. That? If you don't want to... Spiffy, be your mic. Fine. If you don't want to blow up the forge, mm, how about this? I need eyes in there to see what they're doing. I never know what, what they're planning next. But here's the thing. I don't know much about this whole religion thing. I don't even know if I pass as one. Well, the, I mean, you don't... Well, we're, who's in this? Well, that's, that's the thing. They allow visitors. So all I need to do is put some of these clumps in, like, the trash... Or in the bathroom, if they even go have a bathroom, maybe an event, and they'll do the work. Right. I need, I just need eyes in there. I don't All think, right. I don't know if Cicero is going to agree to that. We're saying you walked out. <laughs> Yeah, yeah. You already walked out. about you going no, 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 I'm not saying He's that. Oh, you're gonna have this idea a long time ago. Yeah, well, I'm talking to Rigby. I'm saying, like, well, homie's not gonna help us out, you know. 
the last <clears> one <throat> made, by the way. Uh, and what what are, what are these clumps then? Oscar, what's up? Said what are these clumps? These are my small homunculi that I've created, and they will be my eyes inside. All right. Can if you don't want to, if you don't want to fight, if you don't want to fight the tech piece, I understand. What? What? Okay. I at least want a safeguard. What do we gain if we safeguard it? What's, what's the benefit? You help the people, or is that not enough? Is there something you truly desire? Hmm. I'll I'll take the clumps. If we if I end up in that tower, I'll I'll drop them off. But there's no promises at the moment. You cool with that? Oscar. What's up? <laughs> can you can you not hear me sometimes? No, no, sorry, I'm I'm running to you right now, sorry. Oh, okay. Yeah, I said I'll take the clumps, but there's no promises at the moment. I also probably need to talk to my god to see if this is cool with him. What is Melody thing? What? Hold on. So, Rex, what'd you say? I said no promises at the moment, but if I end up in the tower, I'll drop him off. And also said if I have to speak to my god to see what he feels about this. Oh. Uh, okay. Take as long as you need. All I right. have nothing else to do today. Thank you. And then we'll, we'll probably be on our way. Thanks, Grand Wizard, for the help. No problem. You can return any time, guys. The same with you, Nida right. and Melody. Well, you can play me. Sword Skippers next time. All right, he closes okay. it up. He's gonna escort you guys out. Cool. Uh, All right, cool. cool. All right, now what did you guys need to do here What's in that? the city? What did you guys need to do? In the gas city? is one of the pillars. Oh, okay. Yeah, I, I kind of just needed to. Get my, I have to go to the forge and get my app analyzed. All right. You want to go do that job that we got? Uh, you guys can go do it. I can, I can just go to the forge by myself if you guys have other things to do. We can meet up, uh, I don't know, at the front gate. Because I don't really know of an in here. Uh, Ciceros, why don't we go take Cassius to the forge? Yeah, I'll go with Cassius. All right. I have some questions anyway. I don't think Cicero's is happy. All right, and uh, with the rest of you um, uh, exiting the Grand Wizard, uh, Rigby, um, Night Eye, and Melody, uh, you guys have made a friend, the Grand Wizard. He lives in the Soots. Cool. Cool. Uh, uh, Bron and, and Cicero's are on off edge. What's hmm? up? Uh, Braun and Ciceros are on edge for the fucking uh, Grand Wizard, but other than that, this is where we'll end here. Okay. Right. You guys will continue this storyline next time. No, no one has no one has taken a long rest yet. Oh, so maybe. maybe next time. Maybe next time. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Cool. Wasn't this a? All the, I know about the Wizard is that he doesn't like Ciceros. It's it. I don't know. I'm kind of sketched out of the story like... completely, considering that's literally not tech priest behavior. But who knows? I mean, I mean, like... you said there's different sects. Yeah. So maybe maybe these tech priests are just like. Yeah, but the whole to... common theme of the sect is to help poor people. Like that, that's literally what our that's, whole religion is founded that's on. That's also another reason I didn't just go. Oh yeah, let's do it. That's why I said I. Well, need not poor people. Let's not put words in people's mouths. It's help yeah, society. But... Yeah, it's society. Words where they don't belong. Yeah. But I yeah, also but society counts as poor people. I also want to see well, I want to find out more before I just fucking agree to do some shit. That's why I didn't just fucking I oh, don't know. Cicero has his ideas of what's going on, but yeah. he's not Peter, get, Peter gets it. Though. Peter understands. 
Kevin finished one of his quests. He got he got the sloppy Joe special. Let's yes, go. sir. All right, and I did mine, right? Yeah. So let me give you your second set. The fuck was that? I said cool. Oh, I heard. I was like, what the fuck? Yeah. <laughs> uh, sadly, you wouldn't have been able to do it, but at, well, one of them. But I think you could have done the rest. Who? Ah, let's talk about sister. Who the fuck is the first person? You know, you'll, you'll, you know, it'll happen when it happens. Okay. Uh, that being said, this was a great session. I had fun. I hope everyone has fun. Yeah. This was epic. Yeah. Uh, do you guys literally, literally, look at that on, on not dying? Yeah, I know. Fucking. You guys are not giving the Grand Wizard enough credit for literally fending off Thanatos and Hades. I mean, we don't know who those are. We they just... don't know who it is. They can't give them enough credit. Okay, <laughs> well. But you're saying, like, these are people that we should know. No. So is, ever, is, ever, no, is I, everyone... I fucking told you guys, God of Death and God back of Underworld. He held back Bingus the God of Death. Ah, uh, okay. <laughs> yeah, like... <laughs> Don't rain me, right. Vazelon. If you're like, not going to take if my word we for there. it, then shit. All right. But... I mean, it might have been different if we were there, but, like, you know, like... I mean, me, Spiffy, and, Spiffy and fucking Javi were there, so... It's not like yeah, you're only and, taking my word. I mean, yeah, but... I don't know. One's a fair... And another, also, why... Is, I, don't I don't know. know if, if someone told me you fended off a god of death and a god of the underworld, you guys are just like, ah, I don't know the guy. I mean, it just seems kind of unbelievable from a glance if you think about it. Like, well, if I walked to you on the street and I said it, you know? Are you not... Okay. I did not just walk up to you on the street and go, I fucking No, this is... Me, I, I believe, Spiffy I believe saw it happen. I did something significant, for sure. Because yeah. I did think Spiffy was... A, like, a demon was going to kill Spiffy. So I could believe he fended off, like, a demon or some strong spiritual enemy, but... I mean, he... Like, I don't know. Like, I acknowledge he's strong, sure. Yeah. I don't know, he hasn't... He hasn't he's he's only done well to me so far. I mean, yo, he broke me out of jail. Oh, well, he bailed me out. Mm -hmm. I mean, it is what it is. Yeah, it I mean, does but that like stuff like, wasn't, like, for free, though. You did, you know, have to give him shit for me. He did also... Well, okay, you don't know that he fucking... Okay, uh, well. laundered a hella hella gold to us for hella illegal shit. I don't know. From my perspective, this nigga has been nothing but helpful. You know what? I just oh, I This guy literally is doing illegal shit and drinks all day. Like, I don't know. Like, to me, that's already that red way. flags. Yeah. It's definitely red, red flags. I don't think drinking's a red flag, but that's drinking true. constantly, yes. Yeah, Th that's oh, I'm sorry. I didn't know this was an invention. Fuck all Yeah, I know. <laughs> Dude drinking is 100 years constantly old. Is Dude definitely... is over 100 years old. That, that makes it even worse. Let him, How does let that brother, make it worse? Let a brother live. Bro, Roger's being a big hater on it. <laughs> no, I'm just being lost. <laughs> it's because he's like, the grand like, wizard, like, man. Drinking all the time, 24-7, that is a red flag. I don't yeah, even know like... if we drinking. We I've known him a day, not even a day. <laughs> and all we've been doing is like playing board games, fighting and gods, <laughs> and that sounds like a great <laughs> Saturday afternoon, bro. Like <laughs> you fucking, he broke. And it's not even like it. beer; it's straight rum. Like you guys are like drinking rum like it's beer. He's a hundred years I old. Mean, I don't know his fucking. It, your age does it, not increase your fucking alcohol Like, like look, like if it was, if it, if it ended at that, sure. But then he started talking about bombing the church, and that's kind of crazy. Yeah. That's. Yeah. We've heard because it's not just a like, priest there. It's you're like not a bunch of into it. His people. point of view, or if you his point of his view point is of him view. being a terrorist. That's his point of view. Uh, just no. Yeah, he's literally no, bombing yeah, innocent no, it's people not. that it's are not, not tech his, priests. His point of view is that the fucking tech priests have fucked up, fucked him over, and fucked the people over, and are doing yeah. hella shady shit. So you're willing to bomb innocent people? I I haven't but. said I'm willing <laughs> to do it. I've I've literally made it a point that I didn't agree to to do that. 
until I know more of the story. If I immediately was just like, let's fucking do it, then that would be bad. But that's not what I did. I, I made it a point to go, I'm not agreeing to anything yet because I don't know enough. But if it if it is generally for, for a good cause, and I'm even going to talk to fucking Bahamut about it. No, you, you niggas aren't giving fucking the church. men a fair... A fair, Ma- a fair <laughs> the terrorists? Oh, the I, I, I convinced him to talk to you, and he talked to you reasonably after yeah. fucking hating all tech priests. So, I mean, his mind can be changed. He's not just... That's one track. Uh, I'm just gonna I, I slip this I in. I don't think hold on, hold on. I just wanna slip this in. So I think gonna... he's just more angry that he did lost his job to technology. Well, that's. that's... I think. I... Hold, on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I just wanna say I'm gonna group you all together. You all going in the forge together, just so I don't have to deal with two different groups uh, for longer than I have to. Okay. All right. Well, yeah, because I don't think I don't think that Gaius and uh, Knight I have anything to do. Right. I'm just writing shit right now. No. I'm trying. I'm trying to find something to do, but I can't think of anything. Yeah. So yeah. For, I mean, for now, for now, you guys will go to the forge. I thought they were gonna thing. investigate the missing person. No, I I'm thought not that's doing what they were gonna do. No, I'm not doing that. No, okay. cool. Right. Oh, what do I get for my mission? By the way, Oscar. Yeah, it hmm? seemed it seemed like he was really mad about like there being like. Oh, uh, you get five scrap. Like at a, least for a, now. A poverty class, thing. and his job got taken, and then he's just blaming missing people on the tech priest. Like I think in every city, there's gonna be people living in the dirt. Yeah, I don't think I don't think he was mad that there are poor people. He was. He's like, you think these people are living down here of their own choice? Like, it's... well, yeah, that it also could be different. Like maybe they were forced down there, or they could be. I don't think better, everybody but... would that's down there is forced. Like, what, what's the? I we want to know the population percentage, but he like, did if they like we forced people down there, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, he, he, he did say that, but like that's so, that's a crazy thing to say. <laughs> I know it, it's it's crazy how how fucking against this guy you guys are, are already. I, I, yeah, like, because we're looking at it from a logical point of view. Like we, so we am I. don't have. Like, what do you mean? What anyway. what illogical thing have I said so far? Like, what have I? Like, I, I think it's crazy how you like you just talked about like blowing up the fucking church and starting the war, and that he's like on the right side of this at, at, at all. Like he's always oh, he seems like a cool dude. Like he's a terrorist. Like you've befriended a terrorist, and like he just had a bought hella illegal shit from you, with a shit ton of money. Sure, it helped out. So you think it would have been better if he like turned me in? No, that's not like, the point at he's all. Helping. You, that's well, not, that's not the point. We're not say, like. Like just because he helps us doesn't mean he's a good person. That him automatically helping us is like not he, equal he to helped good person. like like. You're hella criminals for stealing that shit and trying to sell it, right? Like, that's how, uh, like a hella illegal thing to do. And then he, like, supported you in that? And then, and then, well, you played games and he we bailed your friend out of jail? We did it for a good he got con- he, he was planning to do a jailbreak, and now he's talking about starting a war. Like, this, I, I don't know how you guys could see him as, like, a good But the dude. reasons he's doing it for is to help people and to fucking... Stop these shady Fine. people or the fucking. But again, you're also said, believing everything. He that, does that all that I'm not believing everything. I'm literally saying I'm gonna figure out more before I make a decision. Yeah. Like you guys are like mega anti him without even like finding we're, anything else. We're out. not even anti him. We're just like considering everything, and we'll, we'll make a decision later. But from what we have so far, he's, he's not a good guy. Like it's obvious. Like you're you're mad at us for seeing him in the worst light, simply because we're going off the fucking facts we've seen. Yeah, like, like, uh, like what, it, what, if I, we go to the forge really, and we find... Really hard to, like, we yeah, like, if we find out new information, like, yeah, the tech priests are fucking yeah, shit that, up, then... That's what I'm saying. Right? I'm, it's hard to continue Look, this conversation without knowing more. Like, like, we could just keep talking, but, like, until we find out that anything's happening, then it, it but really still, at matter. this point, he's still a bad <laughs> person because he's literally just breaking laws. Regardless of what he's doing it for. Okay, you know? I I don't think that necessarily just makes him a bad person. Breaking laws doesn't make you a bad person. Okay, not not really. That's a that's a little bit of an ignorant statement. Just breaking laws make you a bad person. 
Yeah, I think you could be you could break laws to be a good person, but yeah, I yeah. okay. The laws that he's breaking. What buying stolen paraphernalia? You've never bought anything ever that was stolen before. No. Actually. No one here has ever bought anything ever that was stolen before. I would never do that. No. Okay, yeah, I, I, I think, think I think so. you need to yeah. put more. Con- no one here has bought in stolen shit knowing it was stolen. <laughs> No, we yeah. stolen. No. Realistically, there's a high chance you bought something that was stolen. There's, there's a pretty knowing. damn good and also, chance. And you also, you're also forgetting that the fact that the things that you stole are illegal to have in the first place. Is it illegal to have? Yes, he said that multiple times. That even he, like have, a he didn't. He didn't say that. He didn't He just said he did, like, he did not a, say that. It's a suspicious thing. It's suspicious as fuck that we have so much of it. Yeah. He's yeah. You said you didn't. It's not illegal. No, it's. It's suspicious that these random Joe Schmoes have a hella massive amount of this stuff that is hard to manufacture. He, he didn't that it's not illegal. He, he he just specifically said we'd be in trouble if we got caught. He didn't say with who because yeah. that is it true. is suspicious yeah. that we have a lot of this fucking pure. Yeah. I don't I don't think the fact that he's powder. broken some laws makes him a bad person at all. Because I don't know, that's that's to me that's a little bit of an ignorant statement because laws. You also and, know he is laws, are, laws are laws are fucking skewed to whoever's in power. In some scenarios. You but also anyways. know he blew up some buildings. Yeah, that was like one of the things the guard, like the guards first said when you were walking in. They're like, "Yeah, this is fucking." Windy. What buildings they were though? That that does matter. But you do know he also blew up buildings. Yeah, like I said, I don't know enough about that. I don't know. I'm going to keep this Grand Wizard door open, though. I think it would be pretty cool to have a fucking dope-ass wizard on my side. <clears throat> Meh. Because we don't have to just blow up a, the... We can find another way, maybe. It's not like our only option is fucking... He's a, he's a strong ally to have, at the very least. Yeah, but he's radical as shit. Regardless of these, yeah, he's hour, fucking yeah. epic. I'm not here to do no fucking passive world building, man. That's ironic as fuck coming from you. Is it? Yes. How is that ironic? <laughs> oh no, dude. Who who else chat GBT the backstory? <laughs> oh, chat GBT a backstory for a fucking. You told me I could first of all. No, I didn't. I just said I wanted the backstory. I didn't say you could chat DBT at all. I don't know where you okay. got that. Well, from. also, Everybody you're bringing up a different campaign. I mean, yeah, but it's just funny coming from you that you don't want to do passive world lifting when you don't want to put effort into the backstory, you know? There is Ooh, that's crazy, because I just wrote a backstory for my character right now. And also, I, okay, yeah. you're, you're getting a little, little little, salty right here. I don't I don't know why you're bringing up the chat GPT thing. Uh I'm just making a point. But that's Kevin, what time do we have to get there? Oh, we have to be there by 6.30, so an hour from now. All right. Uh, I'm going to take a quick shower, mm-hmm. and I'll come up here back. Uh, great session. I ho- I think everyone enjoyed it. I guess some of the people are playing. I know that people that didn't play probably didn't get much value out of it. I mean, I mean it was entertaining to watch.